what, what the haters talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? A man who was being held on a misdemeanor charge was sexually assaulted by one of his guards while he was at the hospital on February 3rd. Now Officer Carlisle Calhoun, 46, a 10-year veteran of the police force, faces multiple charges in the alleged assault. Police were holding an unarmed suspect for a misdemeanor charge when he began saying he was suicidal, leading Calhoun and another officer to drive him to a local hospital for a psychiatric evaluation. With the suspect chained to the bed and the other officer away eating food, Calhoun allegedly began giving the man relationship advice before massaging the victim's feet and sucking his toes. Then he allegedly grabbed the restrained man's genitals, pulled out his phone, and snapped the picture. The other officer returned, and Calhoun then escorted the man to a restroom. In the restroom, the officer allegedly performed oral sex on the suspect to protest before they returned to the hospital room. When the officers left, the victim reported what happened and swabs were taken that contained DNA matching Calhoun's. Calhoun was stripped of his police powers when police first learned of the allegations and placed in a desk job, but was not formally charged until Tuesday. He was ordered held on a $200,000 bond, charged with aggravated criminal sexual assault and official misconduct. He will also now be suspended without pay. Not surprisingly, Calhoun's attorney said that he was well respected. He also said that he helped to take care of his elderly grandmother and performed a high pressure negotiation with a knife wielding man last year. So because he did all of that, that means that he can rape. He can go around raping. That's cold. So, an officer who is a cop sucker. Now, would he be a cop sucker? No, no, no. He'd have to be sucking a cop to be a cop sucker. But he is a sucker that happens to be a cop. If he's that bold to assault a suspect in a hospital room, imagine what else he's done. Imagine how many more people he's assaulted. He was very bold. And I'm going to tell you something else. His partner knew what was going on the whole time because why else would he allow them to go into that restroom together? His partner probably was just like him. Who knows, man? You would think something like this, uh, a toe-sucking cop would be weeded out in the psych part of the interview before they get hired, right? That's too much like right here in America. It cannot be overstated that Carlisle Calhoun is a grotesque, stinking human being. He should take some of that money that he made while out there on the beat and open himself up a massage parlor called Foot Action. And give all of his cop buddies a discount. I'm sure he'd love some pig feet. No more talk. What the talking about? Yeah.